Today, Columbiana County's first ever Pride event happened in Wellsville. Now, the event has been met with backlash from local churches since it was announced. First News reporter Abigail Cloutier has the details new at 11. Cars lined the street for the first Columbiana County Pride held at the Wellsville Alumni Center. Across the street, members of three different area churches protested the event. Even with whatever's happening out here, we're still in there and we're still celebrating us and who we are and uh, just collecting as one unit and being together as one community. Organizer Joey Shalott says they did hire security out of an abundance of caution. Across the street, the Living Well Church pastor Dirk Hall was one of about a dozen protesters protesting, saying his concern is the event, which included what Shalonk says is a family-friendly drag show, was not appropriate for children. Our, our worry is that it's going to corrupt our minds and they accept this as okay. Our identity is in Jesus. And once we accept him as our Lord and Savior, he changes our life and the born-again experience. And that's what we want for these children. We don't want this corruption in our town. Though there were kids attending the event with their families, I was asked not to film them due to safety concerns. Columbiana County native Emily Scott was one of the drag performers. She says to her, Pride is all about creating a safe and accepting community. If we could just have one person come and feel welcome and feel accepted, then, then we succeeded. And I can confidently say that we accomplished that goal maybe a hundred times over. Hall says his goal was to have those attending the Pride event to accept God, noting his church does not condone being LGBTQ. Members of Christ Our Life Church and Sovereign Grace Chapel Church were also present. We stand in love for the village. Judgment will come down on this village and we don't want that for Wellsville. Shalot says he wants to hold Pride again next year. In Wellsville, Abiel Cloutier, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.